Hello, this is Travis and Aaron on camera and this is Aaron's video collection and this is an update on his KTEL videos. First video is The Trojan Woman. You got that as? Yep. The Trojan Woman on KTEL. KTEL's a really nice collection. Um, I'll show you the inside of this one. This is a, there's a few more of their library on the inside of the, these ones. Just hold it there. Wait, zoom in for a close, have a look. Haven't actually seen the movie, you never know what you're going to get with KTEL. The good and the bad. You got that? That's right. Nutcracker, that looks alright. Yeah, sounds alright. Yeah, shows and... Can you see it. what you're looking at there, but... Yeah. Yeah. Is Friday the 13th, The Orphan. Yeah, we, we do. The unofficial Friday the 13th entry. Okay, there you go. Let's move okay, on. Okay, moving on. Um, Alone in the Dark. This is a really good one. Slice and dice. It's great, great bit of artwork on that, you know, like how can you go past it? Look at it. I don't know about a good movie, but <laughs> <laughs> good video good, good cover. Video cover. <laughs> great, great video cover. Yeah, that's you know, when we were teenagers that sold us those sort of video covers. That's, Open her up. That's what sold it. It's got the same thing as that last one I showed you yeah, on yeah, the okay. inside. Yeah. So moving along. Um Every good sugar girl should have one. <laughs> Gildo, I suppose they're talking about. I'm not too sure. Who knows? I wouldn't have a clue. Yeah, sort of slapsticky ideas of back then. Okay, yeah. yeah moving okay. on again. Oh, um, yeah. What's this one? 2019. Yeah, I, I dug this when I was a kid. After the fall of New York. The rat eating. I seen this one when I was about 12, 13 or something. Maybe younger. I thought it was a great. Starts off in um, is that Icon Valley they call that place? Or? Which one? The uh, one in Nevada. All oh, right, yeah. I think it's Nevada. Yeah. Yeah. Same anyway, guy eats that's only ten water. more years in the future, kids. So that's what's gonna happen. It's gonna be bleak, and we're all look like all gonna look like the plasmatics, apparently. Yeah, okay. I'll be a bit <laughs> old and grey, but I'll hang out with all the young chicks. <laughs> So Even if we have to pay them in fresh rats. <laughs> hot, hot, hot wire. <laughs> I'm not sure what sort of movie this is. A fast moving, crazy, action packed comedy. That's yeah. what it is. It's pretty action packed and cool. Who's in that? Oh, look, George Kennedy and Strother Martin. And a, and a short, is an extra film called Driven on it? Oh, I like two, yeah. Mm. Two movies. Two nice movies. One. Uh, Albie Mangles! Well, Safari with Albie Mangles. I knew a guy had a fight with Albie Mangles. Did he win? Remember the cameraman from that from Blood Rush? He got into an argument what, with Albie what, Mangles over something. I'm not sure what his name was. He ended up stabbing someone later in his life, but yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Did he win his fight against Albie I don't Albie know, Mangles? I don't know, yeah. Hope so. <laughs> <laughs> he never really said much, so maybe he lost. <laughs> Dog. Dog Day, it's probably not too bad. It's a, it looks pretty action packed. It's got um, Lee Marvin in it, so it can't be half bad. Lee Marvin's always pretty good. Yeah. Dog Day. On K Tel. What's it? This next one's a, oh, yeah. an original K Tel case. I'll show you the. We've showed you before, we've showed Is you it a few of case? these. I think they are, I don't know. And, um, it's got Ginty in it, that's what counts. Yeah. We've showed you this before, but we will show you again. Um, oh, it's got Robert Gindy in it. Um, these have got reversible covers, which is why we like these videos so much. They're just excellent. As well as putting out bloody... Ginty movies. Robert Ginty movies. That's Ginty's sister fantasy, <laughs> that one. Oh, yeah, we want to talk about this a little bit more. Yeah. We always talk about this one, but... Um, I think we have before, anyway. It cracks anyway. up to his sister. No, I mean, what happens is his sister. <laughs> no, his, his, his sister's killed, then he gets this other chick and cuts her up. 
plastic with set plastic surgery. Gets to a look cut, just like his sister. Gets a cut to look like his sister, and then he does her. And then he fucks her. But before his sister <laughs> dies, he tells his sister, "Oh, if you weren't my sister." <laughs> then he gets some chick and cuts to look like his sister and does her. She's got a big 80s yeah, bush. Yeah, too. That's, that's that's what she looks like. Don't 80s you bush. See her titties. So, yep. Blonde hair with a black bush. Okay. Don't get too excited, Aaron. I am. Here it is. Oh yeah. Leatherface. This is great. I'm immobilized. <laughs> That's, a, <laughs> That's a, one of the worst oh, of genre. Fact, yeah. Look that one up on IMDB. There's another, plenty of good reviews. Another futuristic. I, I, I remember seeing this when I was a kid. I thought it was a, you know, the cover, and I just thought, fuck yeah. I watched it for the first time awesome. the other day. God, it was funny. Yeah, it has the has the bloody combat style of the of the dudes in it. Yeah. How's old Leatherface, whatever his name is. Yeah, what a ham! I don't know whose dick he sucked yeah. to get that part. As you can see in all Maybe these, you as you can see in all these movies, everyone does look like the plasmatics. See, that's the future. See, hmm. Shame, like no, like really good modern bikes made it to hang the on. future. Hang on, hang on, better zoom in. Shame yeah. no modern motorbikes made it to drink. the future, just old Kawasaki. Old quackers and stuff. Yeah, look at that. That'd Quackers. Because cool. I'm going to get myself a Kawasaki because the yeah, world's going to end soon and I'll be needing one. Okay, I'm no. actually going to hang out with Tom Petty because... He survives. He survives it if you've seen the uh, Postman. Yeah, Postman. Who hasn't? Waterworld. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Okay, what have we got here? Shark Hunter. We've showed you this one yeah. before, but, yeah. you know, Frank Nero, that was a crack up. We oh, blue that eyes. You kept fighting blokes with moustaches and stuff. All the baddies had big moustaches in this one, and but Franco Nero, God, love that guy. Oh, shocking Asia too. Probably a bit of ping, going. bit of ping pong ball action. That's up there with your Mondo Carnies and shocking this and shocking that, and that's just a cheap holiday for Australians. Just, just don't, yeah. Just don't worry about watching the video. Just go <laughs> over there and <laughs> find yourself some lady boys. Five hundred dollar airfare and lady boys. <laughs> <laughs> Hero! <laughs> you will be in heaven, my friend. <laughs> uh, the classic. Classic. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Evil Dead. Everyone should have a copy of that. Uh, no need to talk about that one. Much has been said about that film in the past. Texas Chainsaw Massacre. There's another cover I don't have with um, yeah, is it Ktel or yeah it's Ktel yeah. it's just got um, cut up stuff on yeah, the cut. yeah there is another cover for that one out there um, Texas yeah, Chainsaw yeah, Massacre yeah, same one again. Same Blood again. Rush now we don't know we haven't watched this version of it but last one we had just stopped before the end of it no it just like someone's wiped the end of it off it wiped it off yeah, yeah. anyway keep moving Blood Rush. Um, the returning Susan Stress Strasberg again. Yeah. Gabriel Walsh. We've spoken about this one. Oh, we have. Yeah. Okay. The returning. Another 2019. Another 2019. Um, Liza Minnelli. Look at that. So you, with Kato, you're likely to get Evil Dead and Texas Chainsaw Massacre and Liza Minnelli movies. Yep. Try to work that out. Don't know if we'll ever get around to watching A Matter of Time. It might mm -hmm. be just a matter of time. I would if you got to see Liza's bush, but I doubt it. Yeah, you never get to see them. It's always some poor chick desperate and, uh, for money. Oh, human animals. Well, oh, they're, yeah. Well, they're a rotter. We got about halfway through this one, but I know I've seen the trailer as a kid, and I know that... Aaron reckons... I'm pretty sure Aaron the dog... the chick... Fucks the dog. No, the dog smoke blows her, mate. And then the dude gets <laughs> jealous and has a fight with the dog. But I'm sure I've seen and it when I was a kid. Well, no, there, was, there was no talking but, in it, was there? No, there was no script. But then again, maybe I'm just fucking... Tripping. Maybe it was just some fantasy I had as a child. I don't know. Anyway, there's no... <laughs> this is like a silent movie, isn't it? Flip there's it around. No, no talking in back. it. No, yeah, that's right. It's very stupid. It's an arty film. I cannot artwork. recommend that whatsoever. So that art students get cameras instead of film students. Yeah, that warning, sections of this film may seem, may be considered offensive. So I reckon she, I reckon she probably does get blind by I the dog. I reckon she does do the dog. Anyway, <laughs> that's it for Aaron's k -Tel collection. I hope you've all enjoyed it and we'll show you it more in time as we get more. Okay, thanks. Thanks a lot. There's another, there's another video on some guys with a good k -Tel collection. Do you?
Peter Research for it.